Now let us join our hearts and our minds and turn to God in prayer. Almighty God, we come to you this morning in all humility, acknowledging that your thoughts are not our thoughts, neither are your ways our ways. Where we see human weakness and brokenness, you see a way to bring light into the darkness and to work your redeeming purposes in and through us. And so we place our trust not in human strength and wisdom, but in you alone, our rock and redeemer. Lord, hear our prayers that we offer this morning on behalf of the church and the world. Our world is an anxious place, divided in so many ways. And we seem to grow more so each day. Lord, break down the barriers that exist among peoples and nations. Restore and strengthen our common life. Give to your church a bold vision and a daring love to speak and act on behalf of your mission to restore all people and creation in peace. And Lord, we join in your prayer that even amidst our differences, we may be truly one as you, Lord Jesus, and the Father are truly one with the Holy Spirit. And as one people, we lift up those among us who suffer, comfort all who suffer in body, mind, or spirit. May we bear one another's burdens. Lord, expand our compassion, increase our faith, and make us whole as we work together for the healing of those in need. Eternal God, we remember those who are dying and those who have died. Comfort us, Lord, in the sure and certain knowledge that nothing in life or death is able to separate us from your love for us in Jesus Christ. And hear our prayer as we pray together in the way in which our Lord Jesus taught us to pray, saying, Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our debts as we forgive our debtors. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For thine is the kingdom and the power and the glory forever. Amen. <clears throat> 